Hello everybody, welcome, thank you for being here once again with me, thank you for watching my channel Ivana Tero. My dear friends, this is daily tarot reading for all 12 astrological signs for the date November 17th, Thursday 2016, of course. Well, four tarot cards in front of us as usual, as far as I can say, pretty good one. Um, exciting news, as far as I can see, in front of all of us. Uh, I will tell you everything that I can see. Um, activity, enthusiasm, and above all, some breakthrough for many, many people out uh, there. So, let us try to see together what we all can expect during this Thursday. And... Uh, Let's get started. Let's move. Okay. So this is King of Swords, Knight of Wands, Nine of Knight of Wands, <laughs> and the Nine of Wands. Pronunciation is almost the same. And Major Arcana the Sun. Okay. So as far as I can see, basically this is kind of outcome. With Major Arcana the Sun, nothing basically cannot go wrong. Or at least nothing, you know, what is important for you cannot go wrong. So, optimism, uh, enthusiastic, enthusiastic kind of, you know, feeling from inside of you, being happy, and above all, being on some kind of, you know, standby. You are ready to act, you are ready to jump, you are ready to fulfill your dreams, you are hasty, you are anxious, give me, give me, give me the chance, give me opportunity, and then, bang! So, those very good energies are both good for your health, for relationship, for job, for friendship, especially for traveling, if you have opportunity to travel, not only during this Thursday, this is for Thursday, Friday, and during the weekend, most likely this energy will last, because I can see many people out there kind of, you know, waiting, you know, you are waiting, you are already on a standby, and then, you know, some invitation will come, some information most likely this is traveling because of a pleasure, could be could be traveling because of your job, but for many out you, this is basically green light, which you will get Thursday going uh, on to the Friday, especially on Monday, maybe this is only first uh, interview, second interview, and many people will get basically job during those two, three, four days uh, starting from, from now. So... King of Swords, cooperation, basically this is the key word uh, from the very start of Thursday. So be cooperative. Now, let me read what it is written down there. Make harmonious decision, focus on cooperation, balance and partnership. You enjoy friendship and beauty. Okay, you can be woman, you can be man. So basically, I can see you changing your physical appearance and uh, this could be very, very bold, some kind of change, like maybe never, ever before. You can feel already from inside of you, something is going on. Maybe this is not clear picture, you maybe don't have clear picture, basically what is heading your way. But honey, something is heading your way. So with this night of phones, this is some kind of breakthrough breakthrough so don't raise those two swords put those swords you know down be cooperative cooperative because this knight of wands could be leo could be but doesn't have to be leo sagittarius and aries could be a chief manager could be a friend but also this could be your husband your lover on your love interest he basically is impatient to be with you, to fall in love with you, to say something important to you. Now, what is written down there? You advance with energy, optimism and creativity. You are courageous. Progress and success are on the way. Aha. Uh -huh. So now you are ready. Libra, this is for you. Gemini people, Aquarius people, this is for you you so if you're single most likely air sign fiery sign goes together basically this is an ideal 
communication. This is ideal friendship and love relationship between air signs, all three of them, and between fiery sign. So, don't think that this man or woman, depends on your gender, is here to attack you. Because he is not. He is not now in here in front of you to attack you. But somehow, because the very next set of cards, this is nine of wands, you are already, you know, kind of on a standby. You are waiting that somebody will attack you, that somebody will hurt you. But as far as I can see, none of those things basically will happen. You can expect only good things. And I really don't know why you are so frightened from inside of you. Because you are waiting, you know, something bad to be happened. And you already have, you know, these walls all around you. I think, you know, this is walls all around you. Yes, honey, I know. Somebody does not treat you like you deserve, you know. Okay, okay, I can understand this part. But does not mean that every single man, you know, is nasty, treated you, you know, badly. Ain't gonna happen, honey. Can you see, this man is very, very um, enthusiastic about you. So consider to put those swords down, meaning put those walls that basically you build all around you, put smile on your face and expect only the best. Now, what is written down there? Nine of Wands, stand by. You have, uh, you have many past achievements, okay? Now you feel confused and stuck. Proceeding will allow more success. Okay, so now you see you are stuck. You are um, you are kind of you know waiting. You are waiting for some news, but at the very same time, you do not believe that good news will find you during this day, maybe on a Friday, maybe during the weekend, but because the final tarot card is the sun, which basically is success. Don't be so frightened. Put those walls down. And, you know, regardless of area, I mean, department in your life, could be friendship, could be family, could be even your parents if you are still, you know, I don't know, maybe you know young, maybe you depend still on your parents. So you are kind of, you know, maybe you think that you are not good enough, you know, so kind of you are nervous what your parents will say about basically you and your values. Don't be so frightened. Don't be, just don't. Because you already have so many past achievements, now you need to start believing uh, in yourself uh, like basically never ever before. The final tarot card, the sun success, enjoy self-fulfillment. This is good health, vitality, you will receive help from external sources. Now, this is good. You will receive help from external sources. Sun tarot card, this is like a sun in a natal bird chart. This is somebody very, very important to you. Could be older brother, could be your husband, could be your son, uh, could be, I don't know, could be anybody. This is most likely male important figure in your life. Also, good news coming from your children as well. But if you are speaking only in terms of, let's say, love relationship, lover, friend, husband, a wife, and, you know, those kind of things. So put those walls that you build all around you. And uh, try not to think, you know, so bad about yourself. Because you are frightened. You are already armed with not only one, but two swords. And this man, I'm, I'm saying you, this man really is not bad for you. Because he is not. So, there is some kind of sense of breakthrough. So, what it is inside of you, you need some kind of breakthrough. Now, what, what is that? Could be different kind of things because I know that thousands of people watching this video. So could be thousands of uh, different, you know, things in which area of your life you expect, you deserve, you want some kind of breakthrough. Could be different kind of things. So whatever it is, you will receive help. You will receive advice. You will you will receive. 
a phone call you will receive basically what you want to receive now this is the good question what is it you want to receive whatever you want to receive believe me it will come so stand by kind of behaving soon is going to be over and in a good good way now let me try to see what we have in the another tarot deck which is wisdom of golden path and the author is tony carmine salermo hopefully i'm pronouncing name correctly so let me try to see what basically is advice for all of us during this thursday and this is what i have aha uh -huh. now there you go self-worth now this is always 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 important very very important theme subject in uh, in a life for all of us maybe this is area of your life but basically what you need to learn still about yourself i told you you can expect some breakthrough self-worth think about that how much you worth yourself how much maybe this is your problem maybe your self-esteem you know is not as it should be so let me read few sentences from this beautiful book golden path of uh, wisdom of the golden path okay now let me first read affirmations for all of us please my dear friends listen i am golden light i am divine love i am infinitive worth i am a channel through which the gold river of life flows i am love you have a habit of undervaluing your talents and capabilities this is due to a general sense of low self-worth and yet there is so much that is wonderful about you many around you can see this but somehow you don't now can you understand now what this self-worth is all about somehow everybody can see that you are beautiful good person with most likely with a golden heart because we have major kind of the sun somehow you are, you are on a standby waiting that sooner or later somebody will see that you are worthy of love that you are worthy of getting closer to basically what you want so knight of wands this tarot card here this person female or male will bring for you message that you are worthy this per this person is important in your life this person will bring you awareness of yourself of your self-worth and this is the message if you ask me pretty important one so you know truth is not an easy thing to cope with when somebody with good intention want to say something to us uh, first reaction is always don't you patronize me you know or something like that but some people have good intention and this person have a good intention toward you so put those swords down put those walls that you built all around you down and listen what is the message coming from this person most likely this is a relationship most likely so somebody has very important message for you during this day listen listen and think a little bit in terms of self-worth in which area of your life you do not still value you as much yourself as much as you should kind of everybody else see how much you are worthy only you do not see your own 
value. So my dear friends, this is the message for this day for all of us. Okay, this is it. This is our daily tarot reading. Please support my channel. Please do subscribe. If you like, press this like button and please share this video with your friends. Until tomorrow, take care and bye-bye.